A Lockport home on the market for $1.6 million has four bedrooms, six bathrooms, a 14 car garage, and a whole lot of character. It's a lot of garages, so much in fact that the pictures have captured basically the attention of Western New Yorkers now. Doing your side's Danielle Church has the story. At first glance, it looks like just another home in Lockport, but we all know that looks can be deceiving and you have to pay attention to the personality. While this house has quite the personality, I'd say it's even got an old soul. It's almost like a time capsule in there. It's just, I, I just think it's, a, it's an iconic home. According to the listing on Zillow, this home was built in 1967. Makes sense with a gym that looks like it came out of that 70s show. There's also a satin covered toilet. Talk about sitting on a throne. And just about every room has carpeting. That's apparently more common in old homes than you might expect. Go from the 50s to the 90s to the 90s, it was carpeting. You had all your carpet stores and people carpeted everything. They didn't think about hardwoods or tiles. Twitter account Zillow Gone Wild posted about the home and people lost their minds over it. They replied, colors you can feel. Looks like you could play one hell of a game of Clue in there. And my personal favorite, going to need a riding mower and riding vacuum before I purchase this one. Some neighbors who never went inside are now even showing their appreciation. Each and every room in there would be just, just a great conversation piece. But those who have had the pleasure of being in this conversation starter. It was just real nice and cozy. Got to know the owners, Elmer and Val Grancelli, well-known real estate developers in Western New York. I'm told they both recently passed, but always stayed true to themselves. They didn't have a lot of um, need or want to do anything more. It's who they were, and it's what I think most people uh, appreciated them for. They were unique, and together they created a home. Except for a couple minor changes, I probably wouldn't do a thing in there. Even Western New York can adore. Danielle Church, Channel 2 News.